Ooh. So excited to film this. Hey clouds, what's up? And welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Skylar Kaylin, and I'm super excited to film today's video. It's gonna be super, super special, and it also gives me a reason to put on my wedding dress one more time, because, you know, I need all the reasons in the world to put it on, just because it's like, you'll see, you'll see. But yeah, today's video, we are doing a full Panini Tournée wedding dress, accessories, veil, everything haul, so yeah. I am so excited to finally share this with you guys. Ari's trying to get in the room, so she's excited too. But yeah, I've been waiting like three years to share this with you guys and I realized like I didn't give you guys like a full wedding dress moment with the details and everything and there's like, there's a lot. This is literally my dream wedding dress and I just can't wait to show it to you guys in full detail. So let's get started. I do have our wedding vlog up on our channel. That's part one, there'll be a part two coming soon. But you guys got to see the dress, but now you guys are gonna really see the dress. So yeah, this is my Panini Tournée wedding haul. I hope you guys enjoy. And let me just um, start off by saying, it took me so, so long to find my dream wedding dress. Like I had a vision in my head that I just wanted to be in all bling. You know, I always told people, I don't wanna be in white. That's not me, I wanna be in bling. I am bling queen, I love everything bling, shiny. It's just my thing, silver, go to. So yeah, I had literally, the longest and hardest time finding my wedding dress just because it was, there were so many beautiful options but they just weren't me. Like they weren't blingy enough or they just weren't like what I was looking for. And I was just looking for like a certain bling, a certain look. I just wanted to feel like I was going to Oscars on my wedding day or something, you know, give me my moment. And I was getting very, um, like, I guess I'm not discouraged. I was like, maybe I'm just expecting, like my expectations are way too, Hi, like, I honestly talked to some um, designer from Egypt that was willing to make me a custom wedding dress and I was like, that, we might have to do that. But thankfully I had a Kleinfield bridal appointment scheduled while I was in New York for New York Fashion Week and um, I walked in for the appointment and right away my dress was just right there in front of the door on the mannequin and I was like, thank, thank you, thank God. It was just like a breath of fresh air just because I was like, I don't know if I'm gonna find this. I think I'm gonna have to give up. I think I'm gonna have to change my vision of like how I'm gonna look on my wedding day. Hold on, my light's a little funky. <laughs> and um, so I walked into the Kleinfeld's bridal and I was like, oh my gosh, there it is. And they actually have it here. It was just like really meant to be. She was just like standing there in the mannequin looking all cute. She was a little tattered just because it was like the, um, the ones that they tried on. So it had like spray tan and like, all kinds of stuff missing, but she still looks so good on. I will put the video of when I first tried on like the the try on one. So well, it's like not all the way complete, but I still was like, this was my dress. I actually tried on a couple other dresses. What do you think? Yeah, let's go. An actual wedding dress? Yeah. Oh my God. Is it because the other ones in your head? Yeah. <laughs> This one and another dress were like in the lead of winning, but the other dress was very princessy, like a big poof, and I walked out and it was so like, it was fun because everyone loved that dress. Like even the guy who owned Kleinfeld's Bridal, I wish I knew his name on the top of my head. He, um, he walked down, he was like, oh my gosh, you were so pretty. I wish you were a model for me. I was like, call me, I'll do that. <laughs> but yeah, and he walked out and it was just like a moment and it was still a Panini Tournée dress. So it was like bomb, no matter what, bomb. Um, but I was just, it still was not me. I was just like, this is, yes, I'm a princess, but it's just, just not me. It's not the vibe I wanted to go for today. And I decided to try on this dress, my wedding dress one more time. And then like everyone's reactions were like, oh, you look like a princess, a queen in that dress. And no, like this is no, 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 no. And like, I love <laughs> that reaction for some reason. Like whenever you're like, no, 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 don't do that one. No, 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 you need to. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna do that one. I don't know why. I just like love what people don't like, don't expect, or what's not normal. And this is definitely right up my alley, just because it was so perfect, and it was just like everything I can envision and more. So, yeah, that that's what sold the deal. I don't know. I just really love it. My soul, I love it. And it was supposed to be mine. And like when I tried it on, I felt it, and then uh, it was magic. And then I had Panini Torne herself. Oh, magic. Style me and honey, she hooked it up. 
It was so fun. I'm gonna try to see if I have that footage still of everything. Just, I, I know it's in a vlog somewhere. It's in the New York I found my wedding dress vlog. Go check it out. I did have my um, heart emoji over the wedding dress, but same, same. Okay, so it's exactly the same. Exactly the same with the Oh my gosh, good. Holy moly. No, because there is no bear like this. There is no So yeah, that was the best experience ever and she hooked it up with the matching crown and Lavelle. So let's just hop into that because I literally can't wait to dive in. I don't know what I'm gonna do first. I'm just gonna, let's just, let's do crown bell wedding dress. So just stick with me. We're gonna, we're gonna build up. I know you guys wanna see the dress. I wanna see the dress. I wanna put on the dress. We're gonna build up. So this is the crown. She put this crown on me and I was like, I need it. I can't live without it. Like, it made the dress. It made the dress. It didn't really make the dress, but it just made the look. That's what I need to say. <laughs> so yeah, this is so, so cute. Even just a little box that it comes in. I'm gonna open it up and just notice the details are so cute. Even like the inside says Benny Now I'm gonna be honest, there's probably still some hair in it just because I was like struggling not to ruin it when I was taking it off. So I was like, rip that hair, girl, rip it out. Save the crown. Okay. Okay, and here we go. So stinking beautiful, breathtaking. Like, look at that bling. She uses like the best bling and all her stuff is handmade. Like, this is all handmade. She was like telling me all of the details and I was like, girl, can I be your model, please? Like, I will wear these all day, every day. <laughs> But look at how beautiful this is. Like I, oh, I don't even know how to put it on. Marco put it on for me, but oh, hello. So stunning, honey. Doesn't go with the fit today, but you know. But yeah, I just love it so much. It gave me like a Greek, oh God, I'm not gonna have to. Okay. Okay, gave me like a Greek goddess vibe, which I love. I love anything Greek or Egyptian. But let me just put it up close because I know like the, it can be blinding and distracting. Just all the little details. There's so many details, it's insane. Like literally insane. I wish I could just, I don't know what I'm gonna have to do. Just give you all the angles. So freaking gorgeous, I could stare at this all day, so. I'm just gonna put this up or else I'll just stare at it all day. Okay, time for the veil and oh my gosh, this was the most gorgeous veil ever. It was so long and honestly, just because like the crystals that are on the bottom, it was really heavy, but worth it. Now let me try to show you, it's so long. Let me just try to see if I can show you guys. I'll put like a full clip of the video of it like fanned out somewhere, but like this is just like one little crystal detail that's on the side of it going on the side of it. I do have one TikTok of me and Claudia. We were taking this stuff off before the reception and she was like literally put herself inside the veil and <laughs> there was so much room. It was crazy. So yeah. Okay. Yeah, it is so gorgeous. Yeah, I'm gonna just, just gonna have to put it on and show you guys everything. I don't even know how many feet it is, but it's long. Fun fact about this is that, I don't know how to put it on. Oh, here we go. 
And um, not that was not the fun fact. It matches with the dress. Time for the wedding dress. Let's go. Panini Tourne, let me just say thank you so much because like you make the most amazing, stunning, breathtaking dream dresses I've ever seen. And you made my dream wedding dress. Look at this beautiful thing. Oh my god. So bomb. So bomb. Look at that. Look at that detail. I just oh I it's so heavy, I'm trying to like show you guys everything. But you'll just have to see when it's on. But let me just show you guys. So yes, so there's some swirlies. This is something that is cut out so it's like sheer, so it looks like you're naked when you're really not. And there's full support. And the straps are super thick, again, with that sheer undertone. I just lost my nail, just ignore that. Um, but that undertone. And so it makes it look like you're just floating in rhinestones and diamonds and whatnot, but you're really not. And this right here, this little cutout is actually all see-through, but once you get right here, there's actually a lining. So you see, it's see-through, and then there's a lining. Definitely that glam Oscar Met Gala look that I was going for. Met Gala is not the, not the Oscar. I mean, I'll take an Oscar too, but I don't know for what. We go down and it brings in the couplets and the mid cage again this one is actually not sheer for your bottom bringing down all the way that fishnet feel all the way down tight into the veil so yeah gorgeous 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 and the back is so so elegant this moment i'm gonna try it on and show you guys thank you for letting me relive this moment because ah oh are we ready oh hello Breathtaking, gorgeous. Look at it from every angle, just the bling. The back, I can zip it up all the way. Mind you, I'm zipping it up myself. Nice and tiny. Oh yeah, so long, so pretty. Love it, I just love how it catches the light. Okay, and also you guys can probably see this dress fully better in my um, title photo shoot vlog. But hey, another reason. Let me just try it on again. So let me be me. <laughs> now let me put everything on. Oh my gosh. Hello. Like this, this is a moment. Look at this moment. Oh. Whatever. Okay, I'm just gonna keep walking. Yeah. Mood. So yeah. I hope this gives it its full moment because she deserves it. She is the most gorgeous dress ever. Okay, well yeah, this is like the full detail of the dress. I hope you guys love it, I love it. I'm gonna be putting clips of like the train and everything in detail so you guys can fully see it instead of like, I hope kind of seeing in the angles I'm getting right now, we'll see. But yeah, this is very hot with both of these lights right here in this dress, I mean, there's not a lot of fabric, but they're hot and heavy. Okay, so I am going to finish this vlog by filming the rest of this stuff and then I'll see you guys next time. I hope you guys really love this video. I really love filming it and again, thank you for just like letting me play dress up again. <laughs> I hope you guys subscribe and see you next time. Bye clouds, I love you. Did you guys notice the difference? Gotcha.